Okay, here we go. This is week four of CBL loot here up against George and his Malpass Metagross. Um, there is the Heracross that I have nothing that wants to switch into it. Um, Agron, Toad, Decky Dewey, Heatmore. Not really expecting that, but that's kind of interesting. Um, Heracross, Sigilyph. Sigilyph's been a beast for him so far. Um, kind of want to leave Scarf Sulk because I can EQ the Heatmore, knock off the Decky and the Sig, Fire Punch the Heracross, CC the Agron. It's just the Toad, I didn't really want to lead into that. Um, I'm very offensive this week because I don't really have the tools to switch into some of his beasts like Sigilyph and Heracross. So we're just going for it. I didn't really switch into the Sigui. Um Good luck enough onto G. Let's see what he leads. I want to, I want him to lead Agron and to not really know what Moldbreaker does. That's that's my hope. Hey Aeron, there we go, lovely. Yeah, this is great. Ernie's in. Um, Moldbreaker means it doesn't matter that you are sturdy. I'm going to close combat your ass. Boom. No sturdy for you. Down goes the aggro on turn one. Huge for Frostmoth in the back, to be honest, because... I guess heat more still actually an issue for Frostmoth. Let's see um what he brings in next. Could be Siggy. I would think it would be Siggy. Could kinda of see an air flash come in. Air slash oof, air slash two hit KO flurry on. Frostmoth. Air Slash or 2 hit go Frostmoth. Okay, I do not have a switch in. I'm going to have to go Espeon. Oh, Jesus Christ, Air Flash. Mm, a good chance to 2 hit KO. Right, I, I lose him on if he brings in Sigilyph right here. I literally lose him on. Just just don't do it. Don't bring in Sigi. Just don't. Archimedes. Okay. Okay. That's not as bad. Um, I'm gonna go fidget. I don't know what he does here. He could brave bird. He might might be packing a brave bird. We see the decision. I come out. Could just go through the poltergeist. I'll find out instantly what item is. Assault best. Okay. Pluck. He wants to take my berry. Okay. Interesting. He has assault best though. What's the switch into this? Ah, uh, he doesn't particularly have one. So. I can just hurricane here pretty freely. Pluck is an interesting choice of moves for sure. I mean, you could have been running Brave Bird, but I guess if you don't want recoil. Beans, who's Beans? Beans is um this thing, and once this thing is gone, I am telling you, Frost Moth goes crazy. Oh my god, okay. We will fucking click it again. We'll just fucking click it again. Could see a sucker. Oh, we missed a hurricane. Knock off, it's fine, that's boots. I mean, considering that was his best move to hit me, I'm just going to roost off here whilst I've got the opportunity to. Don't really feel any need not to. He could go for the sucker as well. Um, I don't think he will though. Maybe he's got a rock move. Nah, nothing you can really hit me with here. Sucker, I don't even think sucker would kill unless you were like... I've got a lot of bulk on this Noivern as well. Just so I can come in and roost off hits from like the Sigui. Um... Yeah, I need to roost here just so I can switch into Sigui again. Oh, this is nice, okay. Sigrid comes in. Just gonna roost, yeah, that's fine. So Sigilyph. 
I imagine you go for the psychic care. Oh, you could have ice beam. Um, I don't think you're scarf. You're gonna be life orb all day. Um, so I will up to U turn, and with that U turn damage, I think Sulk kills you. But there's no way. I, I'm not bringing in Sulk here. Yeah, knockoff does 96 min. So yeah, I think knockoff could kill you from Sulk here. But I'm not going Sulk. I'm going Espeon. Gypsy. Weakness policy, Espeon is in. Could this just win? This could just win, maybe. Depends what he does here. Goes for the Ice Beam, yep. Oh, that's a lot of damage. If I go... So what's up, what am I at now? 84 HP. That's so much damage. This thing is so strong. If you've got Shadow Ball... And I go to plus one for death. You're only doing 34%, so that's fine. I will opt to Calm Mind here. Okay, what comes in? Archimedes, that's the... Ooh, it is, it is actually Assault Vest, that is a problem. And he could have Shadow Sneak. It's a good play, it's a good play. Um, he could have Shadow Sneak. Am I killing this at plus one? Wow, really, really not. Like, really, really not. So yeah, we just go hard. Hard Norbin again. You can't touch Norbin, I don't think. Well, we could see a Poltergeist here, which would do a decent chunk. Yeah. Oh, it... Because it, he knocked off my item. Beautiful. I've got a free... I've got a free Poltergeist switch in now. Oh, wow, like nothing. Literally nothing wants to take Hurricanes, so here we go. Do you want to take two of these? You don't. You don't want to take two of them. Um, and I mean, if you're not Scarf, there's no way you're Scarf. I'm willing to bet you're not Scarf and go for the flamethrower here, just because it's accurate. Yeah, no Scarf. Okay. Nice. Sigilif goes down. That's two down. Who's this? Toaders, okay. I think I might just hard you turn into Frostmoth and win from here, possibly. What can you do? You could liquidate. No, you're not liquidating here. There's no way you liquidate here. <clears throat> wow, liquidation is actually going to destroy Frostmoth if you're offensive life orb. That's the chippity chip I want. Yeah, we're going poverty here. Poverty Volcarona is in. Stealth Rock, that's fine, that's free. That's beautiful. I, I think I can win from here. Unless that's a Scarf Heracross. Unless that's a Scarf Heracross. That's still an AV Decidueye that hasn't taken any damage yet. So we're just going to QD up. Good Toxic here, actually. That would be annoying. If he does a QD again. gonna go heat more perhaps but you were very low from what I remember oh god yeah you're, you're dead that's a free QD beans is in yet yeah. uh yeah this this just wins I think unless that's a scarf power cross I think I think we might be in for the sweep here. Uh, no, to be honest, um, Assault Vest, Decidueye, 
will we'll live. Yeah, that's gone. Oh no, so this is why I will not live an ice beam. Mm, and this is super bulk. If he's just slapped an EV on it, ice beam will kill. If he's max bulk, yeah, here comes Archimedes. I'm fine with getting the damage on this, to be honest, because Neuron's in the back and he has no hurricane switch in. So I will just ice beam here. Did he just slap an EV on it? He did, he did. He just slapped an EV on it. And that could be game. Poverty, Volcarona, after one QD. Thing is, I had to remove the aggro on, which I wanted to do early with Sulk. My boy Blue is Heracross. I mean, you've got considerable defense, I know that. Uh, he might protect here, but I can't, I can't risk that. I don't want to QD up and just get boxed by CC. Oh wait, you live. You actually live. You do indeed live. Does he protect though? Thing is, if he doesn't, if he doesn't protect for the flame orb, he lives. Oh, I still want to QD again, but that's kind of greedy. When I could just get my damage and then Sulk probably just sweeps up. Yeah, we'll, we'll do that. We'll do that. I'm not going to get greedy. He does protect. I could have QD'd again. Which would have guaranteed... Wait, 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 hold on. That 6% chip. Hold on, that 6% chip from the Flame Orb might matter. Oh, he doesn't get it this turn. Now then, do I want a 6-0? Oh, don't do that. The answer indeed is yes. I'm just going to switch out into my Sandaconda. Reveal the tech. He's going to hit a CC into Sandaconda right here. Which is going to do like 59 to 70%. Oh, and rocks. Oh, he edges. Oh, he, he misses. That's unfortunate. Um, he could quite easily go into Size and Toad here, but I'm, I'm fine. I can switch out. He hasn't... Oh, here we go. Scarf Hurricane, Sandaconda. Picks up the kill. Let's go. Scarf Hurricane. We crit. I don't know, I don't know if that mattered. I think it did matter. I think it did matter, but after two lots of chip, he would have died at the end of the turn to Flame Orb, I think, anyway. Oh, Sandy. Oh, Sandy. This has been brutal. This has been very brutal. Toad is in. Um... We go back to Frostmoth. If I had a QD'd again, I would have just won on the spot, but this is still fine, because I think Giga Drain, Giga Drain should still kill. EQ, doing a good chunk, but not enough, because I resist. God, your defense is piss poor. Uh, yeah, we'll Giga Drain here. Oh, he's faster. I didn't think this through at all. Yeah, <laughs> the 6 -oh! No! Oh, wait, Giga Drain, Giga Drain. Does just pick up the kill and we preserve the 6 0. Oh, sorry. Sorry I had to do it to you, bud. But that is going to be three kills for Frostmoth. Poverty, Volcarona. In. I wish I QD'd on the Protect. It would have just been a much more solid win. I mean, more solid than a 6 it already is, but you know what I mean. But GG's. Um, that was rough. Um, wow. Yeah. See you guys next week. That's a nice little differential for us on the table. See you for week five.